Hello, um, this is my unboxing video for the Ghost Hand 2 DIY Rubik's Cube from Amazon.com. I didn't get it from cube for you and stuff like that because of shipping. So this is my first DIY cube. I've only used store bots before. Um, my average time is around, uh, let's say about 55 to a minute. So I'm not that fast, but uh, enough that I think a DIY would help me. Plus, I'm sick of my regular cube locking up. So, and most videos that I see of the unboxing of this cube aren't actual unboxings. They take place far afterwards. So this, I just got this in the mail actually a few minutes ago. So, let's see. It's going to take them longer to unbox it. Yeah, so it's they taking me a bit longer. longer. So, here it is. It's in wrap. From cube for you I know it comes with a nice bag. This one didn't, but I think this was a little cheaper. So uh, here are, what's this? This is a receipt. Magic Puzzle Cube Online Store. I don't know what that is. Your business card. Yeah, business card. So here's the cube. Uh, I can, it, it's really small compared to a regular uh, here, It's from China. Um, here, let's take the cube out. So here's the cube. So here, it comes with this pamphlet. I've seen this on the internet. It's in Chinese, but it has all the algorithms that you need. Um, and I, on the back, it has you know more advanced ones. It has it looks like uh, PLL and OLL and stuff like that. Yeah, it has U perms. So uh, here's the cube. I've never had a DIY. Oh wow, that's really loose. That's nice. Oh wow, look, cuts corners really good. So. Uh, Wow, this is really loose. I'm going to have to tighten it up. Uh, let me see. I've never opened these center caps before. So let's see what they look like. Never had a cube with center caps. Wow, that's that's loose. <laughs> it's really cool. Okay, so let's take off the center caps. Wow, they're on there pretty tight. Let me pop out a piece or two. That's neat. I like the air cushioning type thing. Sort of like on bicycle playing cards. They have the air cushion. Wow, that's... I'm definitely going to have to tighten this up a bit. It's too loose for me. Okay, so. Popped off the center caps. Came off fairly easy. I had to take a couple pieces out. There are the screws. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but there's really nothing special about the center caps. The stickers are really cool. They don't reflect. I've read about that on the internet quite a bit. I think that's pretty neat. I might replace them, though, because I heard that they wear away real quick. So I'll probably just order, you know, regular Rubik stickers uh, or Cubesmith.com, depending on how much the shipping is. So let's put these pieces in. I would do an example solve on this, but the thing is, I am bent over really far. I should have done this on the table. But yeah, this is uh, really smooth. I, I, it's my first cube. I recommend getting it. Uh, the center sticker actually does reflect, unlike the other ones. So uh, this, yeah, uh, look how well it cuts corners. Again. Oh, that's like no trouble at all right there. That's really good. <laughs> that's really cool. So, uh, yeah, this is the Ghost Hand 2 Cube from uh, Magic Puzzle Cube Online Store. I didn't get it from Cube for You. It was $11, including the shipping from uh, Amazon.com. Uh, thank you for watching. I will be putting an example solve on the internet fairly soon after I do a little tightening on this. Uh, bye.